All right, so now what we're doing here is we're going to, we're creating, um, we're, we're, we're going to create a new assignment. We're going to do this for each of the, of the, of the chapters in the syllabus. I'm going to select the, and, and I'm going to start with chapter 14. I'll go down here, and I think that's now selected. And I want any source, um, I just want the assessment and practice sources. And so I'm going to click Find. And I want to show 100, because that's all the maximum that it, it will allow us to do. And I'm going to select and add all of these. And then I'm going to click Organize Assignment. And this is Chapter 14, 14, one um, practice questions um, chapter 14-1 and um, this is the these are the first 100 practice questions from chapter 14. And I'm I'm going to um, go down here. That's all of those things. This is just practice. So I'm going to click Set Policies. And here I want to make it as lenient as as I can think of. Um, it, it's going to show um, this to. I'm going to leave all of that default. And here, I think, um, values change for each attempt and each student stay the same for every attempt. Now I want this one right here. And then I'm going to click, so values change for each attempt and each student. That allows a student to go back and practice and not memorize the answer. Um, there's no due date on these. It is ungraded. And then we're going to assign. Okay. And we're, I'm going to I'll show you how to do the next one. Um, it's taking a little bit of time because that's a hundred questions. So that's 14 one first hundred questions. Now I'm going to go and do another one, create a 14 two select, um, chapter 14. Um, and it is, um, uh, any source except we don't want to do the test bank. These two mind. And now here, make sure you, you click to 100. This will give you um, the second 100. We're going to select an add all, organize the assignment. Um, this is going to be chapter 14. Oh man, I forgot what that, what, what that was. Maybe you could go back and change these to make sure that they're practice questions. Uh, Fourteen dash two question practice questions and chapter fourteen dash two. Um, you you can practice these questions um, and uh, we want to uh, set the policies on these. Um, and we're going to um, values change for each attempt for every one. And we're going to finalize the assignment. There's no due date, and it's not created. Assign. So then, just to show what happens when we add, um, this is it's going to be chapter fourteen three practice questions. I'm going to add this, and you can. Create this, select, 
in a chapter 14 and then um, and we want any source but we don't want the test bank and we're going to click find and then we're going to come down here and we're going to click 100 and when you do that then we want to make sure we're on the third 100 and we're going to select an add all organize the assignment and chapter 14-3 practice questions um, chapter chapter 14-3 you can practice these and practice these questions um, we're going to set set policies uh, all of that remains the same values change uh, give them a chance to practice it without memorizing. It is ungraded. Um, and we... Oh, I, this is better if you actually add... Students can add, view assignments and assistance after due dates, including answers and solutions. Um, we can click assign. I don't know if you get that. You can and, and change that. Um, assign it. Um, chapter 14, 3. Oh, this got a due date in there. The other ones don't have a due date, so I made a mistake in there. So I'm going to go edit class settings, and there's no due date on these. Ungraded, assign, and that'll fix that. So that moves them down here. And that that should add the, the third set of, of questions there. Um, stop recording.